Welcome to lesson four. On this video, we are going to learn how to do some practice chords. So we're going to be practicing in order to get faster, because that's the main thing. We were looking at some videos earlier where we will we were doing the chords. So to do a full chord with this lesson, what we're going to start doing is what's called a full chord. And a full chord is usually when you do the chord on one hand and also the same chord on the other hand. You're doing the full chord. So this that I'm pressing here is a C, the C. Then I'm doing the count of four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. So this is a C major. We're going to do the C major full chord. Now the purpose of this is to get faster and get better. Then we're going to go G. You can have a look at the music sheet, the exercise sheet for the chords, which is also found on the same uh, Facebook page. So from C, we go to G. to F, then back to C, and the purpose of this exercise is to get faster, to get better and more accurate. The more you practice, the easier it will become. And something else that you can do is press it eight times before you move to the next one. Eight times before you move to the next one, and then eight times, and then move to the next one. And just repeat that till you get faster and better at the changes. So at the very beginning, you'll probably have to keep counting, but as you memorize it, and as your fingers get used to the changes, then it will become more natural. So then let's do the one for D. That would be D, A, G and back to D. So how would we do that? Like this. A G D A G D Okay, now we're going to do the one for E, the E major one. So I'm just doing the major ones for today in this lesson. So the major would be E major. Then we go B major. Then A major and back to E okay now let's do the F so it'd be F then we will go, this is an A sharp, I haven't taught you this one yet, but we might as well do it, and I'll upload it on a different video, then we've got C, and back to F, so let's go. Okay, G is G, D, C, so we're going G, then D, 
and C and back to G. Let's do A. So A would be that one, then E, then D, and then back to A. E. D. A. And the last major one we'll do today is the B one. So we're going B. Then we're going to go F sharp. Then E major. And then back to B. Okay. So let's go B. F sharp. E. Back to B. And that's it for lesson four.